Hey, good evening, everybody. I guess it's technically evening. It's 5 o'clock. Uh, lighting might be a bit more dramatic because I have the window open. I'm trying to nurse a tree back to health. And in fact, I think, yeah, you can see the tree back there. Uh, yeah, the friggin' morons that we got to mow our lawn mowed over the tree. But it's coming back. It's got some leaves that are sprouting. So hopefully I'll be able to replant it in the spring, which would be nice. But we're moving through some more demos today. This is going to be a bit longer because I'm home alone, which means I don't really have any obligations to not do a bunch of big streams. This uh, whole weekend is going to be a lot of streaming. And a lot of watching movies for a project I'm doing with my sibling, which we will uh, we will talk more about when it's released. But get hyped for that. We got the cupcake on deck over there. Let's see if I can get both in frame. Yes, perfect. All right. Ah, let's do this. We're doing the first one, Baobab's Mausoleum. Uh, it's like something way longer. Let's see if I can read it. It's like it's Jacob Jack's Baobab's Mausoleum, Episode 1. Ovnifugus Don't Eat Flamingos or something? I don't know. It's I don't have high hopes. It sounds pretty, pretty pretentious, to be honest. Uh, I am putting the... Um, the Elgato on a dedicated USB port now, so hopefully we have less audio issues going in and out, but we'll see. I'm hoping that my audio is correct in the headphones. Hold on. Hold on. Let me see. Let me make sure that that's all set up correctly. Audience, yes, yes. I see audio in the thing. You know what? I think I gotta. No, nope, turning it up doesn't do much. Well, at least I can hear myself, and I'll actually turn it down just a touch. There we go. That should do it for that. All right, Baobab's Muse Mausoleum. Yeah, Jacob Jazz's Baobab's Mausoleum. I don't know. I have no idea what this game is like. I, I've, as with most things, I've on the uh, eShop, I've seen it around, but I have not actually played it myself. Oh, audio jumped way the heck up immediately. There we go. That's much better. Celery emblem. What does that mean? Oh, skip. Mm. Oh, it's an intro sequence. Got it. I wonder what the music sounds like, because I can't, uh, cannot hear it. Hold on. I'm gonna see if I can switch some stuff around. On or off. There it is. Oh, there's, like, lyrics. A little bit. Hmm. Um. Oh. The audio sounds kind of bad. I don't know if that's the Elgato or that's uh, just the game. Watch rot. Wh what? How do I even? That font is uh, a nightmare. I do like the aesthetic so far. It's like a kind of a, a Sierra game kind of thing. Super pixely. This game is real bizarre. I'm kind of liking it. It's it's kind of artsy. Kind of feels like some David Lynch business. Interesting, interesting. Okay, well, let's let's keep watching. See what happens. The town of Flamingos Creek is a place that you can only get to on the 11th of March every 25 years. A place that only appears in nightmares. Oh, spooky. Channel 3, yeah, that's the one you'd go to for VHS. 11th March, 1990. Albatross Road, 11.11 a.m. There he goes.
Oh. And there he is. A little concerned. Good day, Hildegard. Agent Watrasio Walberg is speaking. Currently in... Oh, okay, yeah, this is like a full-on Twin Peaks intro. This is like a full-on... Diane, I'm coming into Twin Peaks. And these are the most beautiful trees I've ever seen. Wow! Yeah, help! He's like a businessman. Maybe it's supposed to be more deadly premonition with the smoking. Dale Cooper didn't smoke. I can tell you that right now. All right, got knocked out. Huh. Oh. Uh. Creatures. Episode one, Ovnifagos don't eat flamingos. I don't know what that means, but I suppose we'll find out as it progresses. Um, can I move? Do I have control? Oh, I do not. Ugh, oh no. Won't go begin with that. Know where I am. One sec. I remember hitting something on the road. Wait! I think I remember that disgusting mutant deer. The car was broken down, someone stole my wallet, and I lost the phone. I got to find help. Oh no, it's gonna be one of those days. It's a good thing I'm not drunk. Well, yeah, I suppose. Alright, I can move around. Uh, buttons don't do anything. I can move with the D-pad if I wanted to. Yeah, no buttons. Pausing, not a lot to look at there. Minus doesn't do anything. Okay. Uh, there's the phone. Let's grab that. Press the interaction button. I suppose that's A. That is my phone, but it's broken. Can I not just pick it up for later? I could probably get it fixed. You are in Albatross Road. 19 kilometers to go before arriving at Flamingo's Creek. Alright. Coins! I suppose I should check if I could go back this way. Nope. Okay. Well, it's worth a try. Ooh. Whoa! A UFO! Act 1. Eggplant's awakening. That is me. I am the eggplant. What does this one say? Dedicated to John, Diane, and Duty. Well, good to know. I uh, hope John, Diane, and Duty uh, went out went out well at a timely manner. But given the nature of that sign, I doubt it. Welcome to Flamingo's Creek. Population sixty-four. Okay. So I'm guessing that's the the amount of people we're gonna have to meet. Oh, who's that? Who's that squirrel? Beaver. Hi, you pig-headed. Yeah, you like playing with the tie. You don't look like you're from around here, are you, son? What is an FBI eggplant doing in our nice and peaceful neighborhood of Flamingo Creek? Good day, Father Watrasio Walpurgis, the agent. That's what I thought. You have no clue where you are. Welcome to Flamingo's Creek. It's our special town where gloomy things and bizarre adventures take place in. Thanks for the info, but could you, uh, help? What a cheek. Don't interrupt me, son. I'm Timothy Gloucester Jr., but everybody calls me Father Tim. You can always find me in the church north of town. Come to see me and I'll give you cheats to help you in this stinky game. In exchange of celery tokens, which are the coins you will find in our streets. What are you talking about? I just want... Sorry, kid, I don't have time for this. We'll see each other sooner than you think. Well, okay. Later. Oh, he's back. Oh, and before I forget, who is the inhabitant number 64? What does that mean? Is that me? Am I inhabitant number 64? Hey, this is a purple cat. What you got going on? Oh, no. A murder. This looks like a crime scene. Oh, jeez. Uh, can I check the cars? Nope, can't even walk over there. Okay. Hmm, what's up here? Well, there's some coins. 
Sell your tokens. Oh no. If it tastes like gas and smells like gas, the most likely it is gas. I think that was supposed to be then, but whatever. I ain't here to proofread, you know? Can't talk. Okay, we can talk. Hey, what's up, bro? I'm Bob. I need your help. I need a bear, and it won't serve me any of that bar. Damn, I must have run into the town drunk. What do you want me to do, Bob? I don't know, dude. Just bring me a bear. If you got one, I'll help you with whatever you need. Alright, that sounds good. Maybe I'm able to take the truck into town. Wait here. Alright, let me pick up all these tokens. And, yeah. Who's this fox? Oh, it's a rat. She's the rat. Get out of here, lettuce hair. I'm not gonna let you through. Find me someone with pepperoni and I'll think about it. Oh, okay, so I need some pizza. You found an empty beer. It smells good. Well, can I give... Oh, no. I see where this is going. Yep, we're gonna give him a bottle of gasoline. That's fucked up, dude. What the hell? Come on, dude. Bring me that bear. Do whatever you want. Mm, I don't know if that's a good idea, Bob. Give it to me. Go, 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 go. There he goes. Oh, yep, he's throwing up. Take the keys. Drive the truck. Drive the... This truck is fucking massive. Uh, well, that opened up an area at least, so... Well, let's move on. Is that a catapult? What? It's the medieval catapult. If you find the projectile, you may be able to use it. Another type already. Okay. So, catapult. Fine. That's some point and click business. Who's this? Hello? Well, people in this town, I hate me because I got. Wait a minute. That's too close to the road to the. Tim. Hello. The people in this town hate me because I got moss between my teeth and I spit when I talk. You mind not getting so close when you speak. You also hate me like the rest. I mean, shit. You're nasty. Hmm. Salem. I said I just gotta do the thing. Okay, I wouldn't even really call that a mini game. It's just not much happening. What the? F wow, you found the incredible Mr. Nuts. Guess I'm gonna need that guy for a puzzle later. Knowing how these kind of games go. Oh no, am I gonna have to? Oh boy. All right, do the the reverse. Ooh, TD us. All right. Gonna turn the audio up a little bit. Doesn't need to be quite so quiet. All right. I mean, there's not. It's just like swamp noises. Can I do him in, in this? Three, two, one. Aim. Fire. Here he goes. There he goes. Oh, oh dear God, he's dead. Thought we were gonna have to find him some pizza, but instead we found him some, uh, some moita. Well, guess we can get in. Oh, is that it? That's the end of the demo? Well, that was better than I expected. It was weird. It's pretty fun. I don't know if I'll actually get it, but maybe if it goes on sale, I'd say I would pay, I would pay five dollars for that game. Maybe ten if I'm doing all, if I'm doing all right in the financials, but five, more or less the max I'd say I personally would pay for that.
Gonna let the credits end. Thanks for playing the Baobabs Mus Mausoleum demo. Now you can buy the full version of the game. Now I can. Couldn't before. Alright. Well, let's close that and archive it. Okay. 15 minutes already got through the first demo. Nice. Nice. Let's go to Black Hole. Hold on, let me change the title on the stream real quick. Black Hole. All right, let's see how this one works out. Let me adjust the mic a little bit. A bit more of a down mic, you know? Uh, the light's making my shirt look really yellow. It's just white. I guess maybe like an eggshell. I don't know. Let's go. Single player. Uh, some crash notes. Let's just go normal. We're fine. Hmm. Let's go with the fast one. Hold on. Audio's a little crunchy. Let me, uh... Reset the Elgato real quick. I'm gonna opt out. You don't need to know my information. I always opt out of that shit. I don't care. You don't get my information. I already give enough. What about doing this? Alright. Ooh. Oh boy. Okay. Ah, it's a twin stick shooter. Got it. Oh, it's just like asteroids. Okay, fine. This is fun enough. Just need to survive, or what's the goal here? It's very arcadey. Controls decently enough. Um, what direction it shoots feels a little fiddly. If I push straight up, yeah, yeah, it's pretty responsive. Okay. Yeah, wasn't special, but uh, not too bad. I would, I don't think, buy this. I, I, if it's ever free, I might get it. But like, yeah, no, this is, this feels like something you would make as your first like gaming project. This is just like, what if Asteroids was a twin stick shooter and also had 3D graphics? Whoa. It's also incredibly easy. There's like no. There's like no uh, challenge to this. Level complete, I suppose. So, is there gonna be like a twist or. Whoa. Okay. Shop, I guess, probably for upgrades. I don't know, maybe you'll have, like, some alien ships that actually, like, directly attack you, or... Yeah, some more difficult configurations. Ooh, another wave. Okay, okay. Ah, there we go. Some robots. There's some challenge. Okay, okay. Now, do I have to take all the robots out, or do I just need to survive? Ooh. Ooh, -hoo -hoo. okay, this is getting tricky. Okay, okay. It's not too bad. Oh, and if they destroy something, I can still pick up the little knoblies. I don't know, I think they're just currency. Whoa, whoa. Here we go, here we go. Whoa, whoa. Ah, shoot. Ah, I took a little damage. It's okay. Oh, good. I got an extra life. Is it, uh, worth it to have an extra life? Because, I mean, I don't... 
Oh, my health did get kind of low there. This game's all right. Mm, nothing special, so. Nothing, sp I guess if I wanted just like the most standard twin stick shooter kind of thing, yeah, I'd probably just play Robotron, honestly. Because Robotron is classic. But as far as this goes, eh, it's okay. It's not bad, it's just, just kind of bland. I don't know, I'm just gonna finish off this level and then see if it's doing anything interesting. I mean, I could just, I'll just finish the, the demo itself. It's probably not very long. I will go, I will go three levels and if that's not the end of the demo, then I will, I will just quit out. There's not really much going on. What do I, what am I missing here? Is this something I need to do or just like, I have to break all of these rocks? I mean, I can, it's just... Oh, it's a bit tedious. Just a little bit. Tedious. Is that it? Oh, oh. Well. No, no, almost. Level complete. No, I missed the little doobob. All right, let's get shots. Uh, increase rate of fire. And increase the shots. Yeah, that sounds good. Hmm. Yeah, this, this seems all right. It's, uh... I don't know, it just seems like underwhelming compared to all the many, many more interesting like shmups out there. I, if I had to choose, I would honestly go with any other. This this feels like some kind of game, game programming like homework. It doesn't feel like a game that was designed out of the passion and love for games so much as somebody just trying to practice their game game programming skills. Whoop, whoa. Da, 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 da. Oh man, oh. It's getting a little dicey. It's getting a little dicey here. Oh, I died. Oh, I had that extra life. Oh my goodness, there's a big old cluster of guys. What the hell was that? There was like a little saw blade action? That's a little different. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, it's getting a little dicey. It's a little, getting a little dicey and spicy. Duh. Come on now. Whoa. All right. Oh, jeez. I don't like the effect of how it just kind of like closes off. I think it's supposed to look 3D, but it doesn't end up really looking like that. Come on, come on. Level complete. That's that's three. Let's see if it even lets me. Yeah, there's more levels, but I'm good. That game's fine, I guess, but it's pretty pretty boring overall. Deleted. All right. Let's see what we're doing next. Blasphemous. All right, let's change up the game title. Blasphemous. And since we already did two demos, I'm gonna take a 
quick break, so I will BRB. Don't touch the internet dial. Be right back. Okay, we are back, and we are getting ready to play Blasphemous. Let's do it. Make sure my mic is set up correctly. There we go. Team 17, I do like Team 17. They've made some solid games. Uh, Automa Shep I liked a lot. Blasphemous. Pressing the A button. Oh, there is audio for this. It's just very, very much quiet. Let me just... Ooh, spooky. Okay. I don't like this little baby floating there. Discomfort. Pilgrimage. First pilgrimage. Oh, jeez. The sound effects are a bit loud. I'll, I'll have to probably turn that down. Wasteland buried churches. audio down just a touch that should be a good place oh wow oh whoa the animation is amazing look at that that looks great all right so y is slashy b is jump a and x don't do anything r is like a slide dash that's zr then our button is this like block and L looks like it was a health move, so whoops. I can move around with the right stick. And I can do all this with the D-pad. Cool. Alright. Oh boy, hope none of that was important. Ah, okay, it's Dark Souls. You light the fire. I got him. Get these guys, get them! Alright. Uh, oh, can't double jump, but I can grab. 
mean, that just feels unnecessary. Oh, cool. So I can do a little up slash. Oh. Uh, Perry. Right. No, come on. Come on. There we go. There we go. Okay. Hold on, there's like an area down here. Is that gonna kill me? Whoop, yes it is. There were spikes. Okay. I mean, so far this is pretty fun. I've certainly played worse. What was it? A, a Terno Blade? That garbage? Man, it feels real mean to just slash all these guys. Is there any way for me to get down here without dying? Hmm. There's probably like another way in. This looks like it's some kind of Metroidvania business. It's getting a bit loud. There we go. That's a better level. Biliary and recover vital. Yeah, these fill by kneeling in a pre d. Find empty vessels. Okay, so yes, that's that's a heal. Whoops. Tried it. Nope. Come on. Yep, there we go. Cool. Yeah, it's pretty decent combat system. I mean, it's nothing spectacular. The animations are spectacular. Oh, come on. Yep, there we go. Down he goes. Whoa, yeah, these animations are fantastic. Got him. Down B. Yep, the classic. Ooh, secrets. What do I got? A soul. A darked soul. Uh, yeah, yeah. Mm, pieces, pieces of people. Gotcha. Hmm. I can't go through there. Come on, then. Come and have a go, if you think you had enough. Go on. Nice. Oh! Brutal takedown. That was rough. Yep, here's how we get down here. Ooh, looks like a little bonus enemy. Come on, then. Trying to hit me with a whole damn deer. All right. Whoa, and down. Give me that. Uvula of Proclamation. <laughs> Equip rosary beads in your rosary to improve the compass if I... Okay, equip. What's the other thing I got? This. Is there anything I can do with that? Uh, range... Ooh, a skill tree, baby. I need 400... I need 500 at least. That's fine, I should be able to get that pretty soon. This game's actually pretty fun so far. I was I was not expecting much. It was actually super entertaining. Here we go. Oh. Ah, the map. Yeah, it's a Metroidvania. Ooh wee mama. 
Dealies of the Force. In order to use this prayer, open the inventory. Equipped. Uh, ZL. Okay, let's try it out. Whoa. Nice. There we go. How would I get a... Can I double jump? No. Can I like... Just barely? Yeah, there we go. Oh my god, this animation is so like... Detailed. Love it. Dove skull. Okay. Go on then. Hmm. Presumably I want this baby. Oh, I saved. Children of Moonlight. Okay. Protected, saved, whatever. Keep thinking the grass is flashing because the uh the jump animation puts a little speckle. Little bright white line right where I jumped from. Get around him. Get around him. There we go. I haven't. Hmm. I haven't any healing items, so. Should look into that. Oh, I'm at it. Power of the Maya Culpa, Lie of the Pentaphosis. Okay. The advantage of the speed of a fall. I will take Sinful Wrath, actually. Ah, I gotta do it at a specific place. Okay. Damn! What the f- Oh! Ah! Oh! What in the world? Whoa! What is that thing? Okay. How far back did it send me? Well, that's fine. That's not- Oh no, this is like the beginning. Oh no, that's fine, that's fine. It's actually not that far. I'll go a little quicker now that I don't have to do the tutorials and such. Nice, nice, this is a pretty fun combat system, I gotta say. Come on. Bang, clang, get him out of the bang. Boom. Okay. Oh, come on. I hit jump. There we go. It's a very springy uh, ladder climb. I like it quite a bit. Ooh, a little early. Uh, take him out. Yes. Good. Platforming is pretty nice. I might get this someday. This is this game's pretty fun. Uh, nothing much for me over there since I already got whatever. Whatever soul orb thing, I forget. Take him out. Uh, I guess I already got the moon child, so I'm gonna have to do that again. Whoops. Whoops. Well, let me heal. There we go. 
Made a couple of mistakes, but it's all right. Oh, okay. Him from the ball up. Let's knock him right off. Hey, knock that off. There we go. Pretty solid. I'm liking this. Oh. Who are you? Ooh, that's because I died there last time. Right. I can't do like an overhand slash. Fatality move. Oh well, tears for your fears. Tears for your fears, ladies and gentlemen. The Kachix of Daniel the Possessed. No, nope, that's not it. That's not a rosary bead. Oh, can't do it there. Okay, so if the platform is not on screen, you're not allowed to jump down to it. Hmm. Well, let's try this bottom one first. Why not? We're in explory mode now. Whoop. And bam. Bam. Whoops, miss. Whoops, miss. Whoops, miss. Go on, then. Nice, nice. Okay, this is just like a bridge. Uh, oh, green. Green's been nice to me so far. Oh, who's that guy? Sister of mine. A sigh foretold to you. Someone is heading towards the Forbidden Gate. Oh boy, that's uh, not great voice acting. Someone who seeks the purge and excommunication of all that is sacred and rests there. Hmm. No, no. Do not place your doubts on me. I am ready. Voice acting is the first, first bit here that's pretty pretty bad that was that was that was not good well i want to i don't want to do that yet it's a bit early still you know okay hmm oh yeah this combat feels nice I think she glitched out. That just feels a bit mean. She can't defend herself. Um, oh, wait, that's, whoa. Whoa! Oh, bloody hell. Ah, no, it took me all the way back here again. Uh. Well, I think I have a good enough idea of this game. I am going to get this at some point. This was actually super fun. But in the meantime, we're going to... Uh, we're going to just archive that. I don't want to have to go through all that another time. Um, And then I will put that on my Steam wish list. Or a steep Nintendo wish list. Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle. Oh boy, I sure love Blaze Blue. Um, Twitch chat. Current game tile, that's the one. Here we go. Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle. I'm going to tell you right now. I get the feeling that this one is going to be very complicated. So I don't know how much I'm actually going to playthrough of it, but let's find out. Oh, 
I mean, yeah. You need to do it to play the game, right? This one, I believe, is no longer on the eShop. So understand that this is uh, technically not supposed to be representative of their work anymore. Oh! I didn't expect that. That's Ruby and, uh, I from Persona. What? Oh, hold on, the audio is tweaking out. Give me a sec. Just gonna, just gonna und another but dick it get to get a reset the Elgato. His music is crazy energetic. Okay, let's find out if the game's any good. Downloading? What was it downloading? Welcome to Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle. Beta available. Open beta test period, you can jump right into the local versus battle and versus mode, or start with the basics and tactics mode. Oh, well, yep, there we go. There we go. Oh boy, it looks great, guys. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh, that doesn't look good. I mean, okay, it's a beta, so I don't mind that much. Yeah, let's play uh, I don't know, episodes mode? Can I confirm? Tactic, tactics mode. That's what I can do. Oh boy. That certainly looks fun. A lot of tutorials. Get ready. Oh Jesus. That audio sucked. Was that placeholder? That was probably a placeholder. Welcome to Tactics Mode. Here we will explain basic controls for Blaze Blue Cross Take Battle. Uh select the characters you like, but in this mode you use Regna the Blood Edge and Jin Kasaraki. Fighting game. Okay, that's good to know. Insert defeated. Character on the left is one player. Yep, fighting games. Some of the health gauge. Yep, fighting games. Oh my god, it's a fucking fighting game. I get it. Skill gauge. The skill gauge fills. Okay, this is the one you need to explain. Fills as you land and receive attacks. Number increases by one when the gauge reaches max. Stock up to five points and the gauge is consumed. Shared between tag partners. The oblong gauge near the skill gauge is the cross gauge. This is consumed, oblong, I wouldn't call that oblong, but whatever. This is consumed when using cooperative actions with your partners, such as active partner skills and cross combos. The cross gauge recovers over time, so you should be proactive in cooperating with your partner. I messed up. Close, but I'd never lose to you. Lesson clear! Oh. Uh, okay. Next lesson. Literally didn't even get to play. Get Just ready! Read a bunch of stuff. Cool. Uh, pressing B uh, will make them advance. Pressing up will make them jump. Pressing down will make them crouch. Go! Yep. Jump, jump. Got a double jump. Good. Down. Okay, I'm gonna use the D-pad then, because that's a little fiddly. Uh, FN. What the hell is FN? <sighs> okay, since there's nothing to actually play, and this is... Terrible tutorial. I'm just gonna say, yeah, I'm not getting this. So, let's uh, let's just close that out. I'm good. I'm good on that one. Delete. Oh no, it was rare. I don't care. I don't like the game. Oof, it's starting to get dark in the background here. 
But it's spooky month, so it's okay. Let's see what was next. Uh, box boy plus box girl. Wait, actually, let me make sure I type that incorrectly. It's d d d d d there. Box boy plus plus. Plus, plus, box girl. Okay. Let's try it out. Puzzle game, I think. Let's give it a shot. Is there audio? Is there supposed to be audio here? Well, let's uh, let's go with a tail for one. Cause I'm by myself. Hmm. Jumpy, jumpy. B. Create. Whoa. Okay. Not sure how that helps me. One. Uh. Ooh, okay. Hop. Bing, bing. Bop. Get the crown. I did it. Let me out. Stage cleared. There must be audio here. Is my Elgato having troubles? Let me reset it real quick. Oh. Yes. Okay, the audio was just not. Happening. Okay. The medals you get for clearing stages and the target medals. Items. Got it. No. Okay, world one, stage one, box limit one. Got it. Don't fall in the hole. Guys, I get it. Holy crap, you think I can't understand it? That I should try and jump and get the crown? Yeesh. Really do not trust the player at all. My goodness. This gives me kind of a Super Paper Mario vibe. He looks like some of the, the, the pixely characters in that. Sorry, I'm just checking the lighting situation. I might just keep it like this. Because this is October, so spooky. But, yeah. It's kind of nice. Uh, L plus R to backtrack. Got it. Whoops. Whoops. Come on. Get it. There it is. Whoop. Let me through. Yes. Uh... Oops. Okay, I do gotta redo that one. Oopsie. Whoa! Ah, crap. I messed it up. Whoa! Oh, that was close. Okay. I did it! And he did a little dash. <laughs> Here we go. Full bonus. All right. Uh, yeah, I can see potential for this, but I just don't. I don't know. They have they haven't done anything too particularly clever with it yet. One, two. 
Alternatively, I could... Oh, wait. Yeah, because I can't. <sighs> Hold on. I got it. I got it. Why would I do that when I can just do this? Yeah, I think. Right, gravity does not affect. Okay. Hmm. Use too many boxes. Okay. I mean, it doesn't matter because they aren't going to transfer over to the other game. Oh, but now that star is white. Hmm. Gotta keep that in mind. Let's go one, two, three. Two, three, four. There we go. Two, three, four. There we go. One, two. Three. One, two, three, four. Hmm. Well, I don't have to do it the whole way, so. Nice. I did it. No, I didn't get the last medal. Hmm. Disappointing. Oh, well. I'm guessing we get to the end of this and then we're done. Hmm. Spicy blocks. Uh, yeah, that works. Okay, all I gotta do is jump over, so... I did it! Hey, and I got all the medals. Nice. My brain feels so teased. As they say, brain teaser. Ooh, digging. Hmm. One, two, three. three four, five. Now, here we go. Now, there's some clever stuff going on. Oh, you can't go down. That's right. Whoops. Okay. Let me out. Let me out. One, two, three. Two, three, four. And we go. Okay. There's some clever stuff coming in. Is that it? Is that the last level in the demo? What? What? When did that become a thing? You can shoot the blocks now? What the? Oh boy. Whoops. 
Well, that's good to know. Hmm, okay. I would need to one, two, three, four, no, four. Ah, crap, hold on. One, two, three, four. Pachoo! And then we got a one, two, two, three, five. Ah, crap. Oh boy, okay. One, two, three, four. Bam. Scene. A lot of boxes. Bit box boy, box girls. The whole box families. I did it. I'm home. To the box home. Oh, oh no. No. Oh no. What is that? Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. Our whole world. Hmm. Okay. Ah, uh, you're just showing off the other things that show up later. Hmm. Hmm. Different hats, you say. Nice, nice, nice. A lot of interesting stuff. Okay. This game seems, uh, it's not bad. Oh, too tall. It definitely has a lot of interesting mechanics and ideas. Maybe I'll get it someday. I don't know. I'm gonna think about that one. Thanks for playing. All right. Well... That's it for that one. I'm going to be back in just a moment, so I got to take a break, though. I'll be our beat. Do not touch that internet dot.
Okay, I have returned. Uh, apologies for the wait. I had to fold some laundry. You gotta fold it right away to prevent any wrinkles. I'll put it away later. But I gotta make sure. Make sure I don't get wrinkled up clothing. That would that'd be terrible. Oh, uh, I gotta get rid of this. I'll delete it. It's not, like, common enough that I won't forget. Or that I can forget about it, honestly. Let's see. What's next? Started did Bucket Night. Burger time party! Burger time party! Party in the burger time! Let's see how it goes. Oh, Data East! It's been a while. It's been a while since Data East. Whoa. That's pretty loud. Oh, that is the Burger Time music, though. I'm excited. I love Burger Time. Hopefully there is a single player, even though this is a party game. Peter Pepper. Burgers. Sandwich. Hmm. Okay. Ingredients coming back. We genuinely do not need this much story, dude. We get it. He crushes the food with the other food. Tosses a little pepper. Pa. Pa. Spicy. Boy, solo burger. All right, let's do it. My first burger, a mode for one player. Black pepper used for stopping enemies. Refills automatically. Clear each stage without running out of lives. Okay. Run, run, run. Oops. Run, 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 run. All right, let's do it. It's time. Burger time. Yes, it's it's burger time. Come on. I did it. Oh. That's the whole... Okay. Hmm. Fine, I guess. I mean, I don't think a tutorial like this is really necessary for f fucking burger time. Like... Burger time, bro. It's like the most like. Oh no, I wasted all my pepper. I'm trying to jump? Can I jump? I can't jump. Okay, that's fine. Uh, the sausages are no problem because they can't even get over here. There we go. Boy, this looks terrible. It's a terrible little flash puppet animation. Not a fan of that. Burger. Oh, I forgot to change the title. I feel a fool. Burger time party. Okay. It's, yeah, it's, it's burger time, bro. Just let me do the burgers. Okay, the enemies still are not a problem. I do like the kind of classic rubber hose look for the uh, ingredients. It's cute, but it's it would be cuter if it was actually hand-drawn, like in Cuphead or something. And I know keeping things to the, to the level, to the standard of Cuphead sounds like a lot, but like... They did it, so why can't you guys do it? It's just more, you know, time and effort, which I'd like you to do in a game you're supposed to, that I want, I'm supposed to enjoy. Ooh, long sandwich. 
it's a, uh, it's a hot dog. I did it. Oh boy. This big old, big old intro and outro for such short stages is really, really necessary. Sausage is smashed. Can I put... There we go. That's a pretty fiddly thing. I did it. I feel so accomplished. Yo, what if burger time... Get this. What if burger time was worse? You feeling me? You feel me? Hmm? That's that's what they're doing with this. It's just not good. Literally, okay, any button. Got it. It's just like such a like underwhelming way to do burger time. A game that is like a classic. So why would you need to do all this crap? Just do burger time. Why not? Ugh. How many more levels in this demo? Oh no, I didn't do very good. Oh well. I'm not getting this one. I'll say that now. Ready, start. It's kind of neat that there's other foodstuffs. God damn it, getting off the ladders is annoying. Well, that did it. Cool. Next. Okay. I, you know what, I'm already done with this. It's, it's pretty boring. Each level is really slow. Like, just make burger time. Make it look good. That's it. You're done. You didn't need to do anything more. Like, they didn't do anything more. They just took original burger time, a game that you can just walk up and play without any problems, and they were just like, let's just make it worse. Yikes. It's just bad. It's just real bad. All right. What's up next? Bury me, my love. Well, that's not demo, so. Uh, Cadence of Hyrule. The, oh, hold on. I'm just gonna name it Cadence of Hyrule. A game that I do really wanna get, because I have Crypt of the Necrodancer, and I like, I like the Zelda implementation they did. But let's let's play the demo, see what it's like. User cannot play the software. What? It's the demo. What do you mean I can't play the software? It's Sarati demo. What are you talking about? It's a demo. Let me try that again. That must have been like some kind of glitch. Uh, I don't need to purchase it. It's the fucking demo. Okay. That's dumb. Well, we'll delete that for now, and I'll go and re-download that later. <laughs> that was fucking stupid. Okay. Uh, that's the actual game. Actual game. Cat Quest 2. Here we go. Next up. Cat Quest. I I. I I Capitan. Let's play. Oh, and there's a specific game. The specific demo I gotta play, I'll play it next. That um Coco really needs wants me to play, and I really wanna play. 
for the game, uh, The Almost Gone. Hmm? For many years, the kingdom of cast the dogs warred, but suddenly the blade shattered, and the world was never the same again. So we're getting the, we're getting the blade together, got it. Play solo, new game. There is a co-op mode, that's pretty neat. I'll just go one. Oh, more backstory, okay. Two kingdoms fought against it, but fell to its corruption. However, prophecy foretold their return. Those are some muscular animals. Yeah, pecs. For only their light can shine through the darkness. Ha, ba, 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 ba. Okay, okay. I wonder how this lines up with Cat Quest 1. Hmm? Oh. My kings are really back. The prophecy came true. Is me carry the world of peril? Blah blah blah. Fantasy bullshit. Ah, uh, everything sucks. Fix it. Level one. Oh, it's just like, huh? Cat rags. Cool. Whoa. Oh boy, I got a lot of health. Dog rags. Cool. Oh geez. B to roll. On oh, the back of their head says two. It's pretty neat. What's it say? By the might of the first kings, awaken this power in you! Flame purr and freeze paw. L. Whoa. Pretty sick. Okay. That was neat. Oh. Oh, how do I get it? Oh. I thought that was like a treasure or something. I guess that's just to show you that spikes are dangerous. Or that, oh, okay, it's a, here's the thing, if you have a cutscene, it's not as clever. Whoop, 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 whoop. Let's switch to dog. Go on then, I'm gonna have a go. And there we go. Okay, this is like a beat em up. I like this the look of it. It's a real pleasant thing. It's got kind of a vignette going on, but I think that's because it's supposed to be a cave. And we go up. I like that the overworld and the levels are aesthetically very similar. Oh, oh, we slept. Got it. You're not going like this, but evil. Games, you soup, Lanner, and Wolfen. This was you. Yep, I guess we were kings by the end of the last one. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't play that one. King's Marker. Ah. Fast travel. Okay. South Pot. It's like, yeah, this is blood. We're in feline guard now. Rules here, though. Blacksmith called Kit Kat promised to help us meet me there. Oh, and welcome, your meow justy. I'm not allowed to. Oh, and even the overworld has, like, dudes hanging out. Oh, oh, oh. oh, I like this. I like that the, uh, it's like walking on a map. 
but that makes sense for fantasy. Fantasy is always kind of like political, and what's more political than the lines on a fucking map, you know? Ooh. Make tea, not war, as they say. I should not have come in here. I didn't notice it said level 10. Hmm. Hello? I've heard that there's a magic tablet in a cave nearby. That cave? I don't dare go in, though. Can't go in there. Can't go in there. Heal. Heal and save. Uh, have you heard of the bug keepers? They can help you abandon quests. But I've never taken a quest, so I haven't seen one. That that tracks. All right, what's in the cave? What's in the cave? Level six. I will wait. I'd probably do that at about level five. I think I'm a risk taker, but ah, uh, so much. Oh, yep. Can't go past that line. Hmm. I've been reading uh, the rules to Oath, which is a game. It's a board game that I, I uh, pledged to on Kickstarter. It's by Leader Games, my favorite tabletop game company. They made Root, which I played on the channel here. They made Fort, a game I'd love to play on here if I can figure it. Probably tabletop simulator, you know, um, which is just like a deck building card game, but it's super fun. And Oath is just a super complicated legacy like war game. I'm I'm stoked. It looks super cool. Your meow just see something happen to Kit. Uh yeah. Take a look at this note. Go for a little bit. We'll be back soon, y'all. Y'all. It's two days ago. I'm worried she's in some sort of trouble. Hmm. Oh. Your roughing this. Nice. Give me that. I am the keeper of all stories in time. Do you wish to reverse time on this quest? No. Okay, so that's just, if you don't want to do a quest, that's how you cancel it out, got it. That's pretty cool. Who the heck are you? Well, I guess we won't know till later. Ah! Help me, y'all! I'm gonna assume that is our Quarry. Yep, there she is. Ah. Closed. It's hard to open and close things with one hand, but dang it, I can do it. Hold up, attendant. You're the one Curry told me about, ain't you? Oh, no part of my rudeness, your majesty is, but I'm at my wit's end. I'm too lazy to get more there. Well, you help me, police. Yeah, I suppose. Guessing, yup. Whoa. Oh, resist. Shit. Resist. Okay, so I guess we just gotta trick him over. leave anything? No. That'd be too easy. Oh boy, they attack pretty fast. It's okay, though. You got a um, oars. There's more over there, your meow, 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 justies. Coins! Gonna need those later. Go, go, go. I'm glad it doesn't allow you to roll off the side because that'd be a pain in the ass. I'll just switch over to the, uh, the one that was playing a little better. Night Harbor. Why, I'll put that on. Me cat. <coughs> All right, back. Give it to Kip, Kip Bop, whatever her name was. K 
Kit Kat. I'm impressed. See you back at my shop, y'all. Heart. Cute. Alright. Well, that wasn't too bad. Wait, the tax is how much again? Oh, sorry, Bible. All cases over for the new laws will face persecution. Oh, fine. Take it. Hmm, I don't trust that. I need a golden key. Alright, let me in. So Kid here is going to be our own personal blacksmith. That's right, any armor needs upgrading, come to me. Wanna upgrade your armor? Uh, sure. Done. And the dog rigs. Hmm. Cool. I mean, I guess I should just upgrade as much as I can, huh? Uh, yeah. Not enough gold. Fine. Hey. Is a wizard. Awesome news, the mages want to help fight Lionheart too. Let's create the arcane head potters. Where they at? Where they at? This is a pretty fun system. I think I might get the... Well, I'll get the original first. But, uh, yeah, this is pretty nice. I like it. Alright. Hey. Let's hope the mages can see just some powerful... Magic. I told you already, it's the theory of infinite timelines. Meow. A dog? Ooh, we're being invaded. The ones I told you about. Well, my wish is quickly come and shine, then you meow just sheesh. Hold on, let me. Well, actually, I'm all healed up. Let's go. Walk up to the Universal Yarn Ball to upgrade your magic. Did you want to upgrade your, your magic? Why, yes. I can't. What a useless fucking thing. Huff puff. The liner soldiers are coming. Hurlies, you must protect us. Lightning staff. Alright. Staff. There we go. Phew. Got it. Boiler of King Lionel, all mages must be persecuted in Tartu Cucumber. Step aside, you two. I don't get, I don't get what that joke was. I think, oh yeah, because cats don't like cucumbers. I guess. So Mr. Rocky is extremely very weak to magic, right? Oh, no let there be that. Oh good, it's homing. Mr. Rocky, no! Oh, level 5. Cool. Oof, didn't roll out of the way. Okay. I did it. And then we talked to them and they're like, you did it. Quest complete. Now I can upgrade my magic. Thank you for playing. Hey, thanks for having it there for me to play. That was pretty fun. 
I'll archive that and probably get the first one sometime. In the meantime, we probably have enough time for one more. Before the uh, top of the hour, that is. I'm going to keep going after that. This is going to be a longer stream, but... Uh, ooh, let's not do that one yet. Clubhouse Games Guest Pass. Coffee time. Oh, that's going to be a bit long. Let's go with Crocs World 2. That should do it. Crocs World 2. Let's see if this is any good. If it isn't, I'm just going to skip Croc World 3. Because, I mean, I doubt they'll do anything. Play World 1, World 2. Got it. Oh, cool. I like his janky little animation. That's cycle. That's, that's pretty neat. That's fun. Um, okay. That's cute. Snails. Oof. Smashed. Jeez. It's a bit, uh... A bit scary. Bwomp. Okay, I guess not. Can I not jump up higher? I can. I can just... I, that's all, how high I can jump. Oh no, I'm not even... T this is... <sighs> Boy, this is not great. I must be honest, this is not great. This is if, this is like when, um, um, you would play like flash games that were basically just Mario, but worse. Like basically someone just trying to recreate Mario in flash. Whoop, yep. Oh wait, that's more Sonic with the jumpy fish. Oh. Okay, so you can do multiple stones, but they get kind of, kind of wiggly and jiggly. Yikes! This music is pretty, pretty droning. Trial mode consists of just two levels. That's all you're showing me, and you want me to play the game? Get out of here! Get out of here with that! Are you serious? No! Fuck off! That was terrible. Deleted. That only took three minutes. Yikes. Okay, so yeah, well, I'm just gonna delete. Well, fine. Crocs World One took s or two took so little time that I'm just I'll play Crocs World Three. Let's see, see if they improved anything. I'm gonna guess no. See if it's even remotely different. All right, same music, bad sign. Uh, there's an overworld now. Oh, and I can play as Rudy. Well, I'll play as Rudy then. All right. Rudy's a cutie. Do love me a kangaroo. Kangaroos are buff as hell, though. You ever seen like video of a kangaroo close up? They got packs. They got friggin' packs. All right, the swimming is incredibly janky. Also, with that first game, there's only 60 levels, they said? So that's, that's a hundred, that's like 120 minutes. It's like three, that's terrible. It's like a super, super short game. Ah, I can kill all the enemies. Of course, I want to be Route 8. He's a ruddy kitty! Well, I can't do anything about that. I don't have my helmet. Give me the helmet. Oh, okay. Bop in the block. Up! Oh. Bop in the, the block underneath him doesn't kill them like in Mario. Good to know. Okay, it does if you have the helmet. Got it. The helmet, in case you couldn't tell, is just the Mario mushroom. 
but they didn't want to draw a different model, so they just slapped the cheesy little helmet on top. <sighs> this feels like a fake game they'd make for like a GameStop commercial. You know how they always show like the stupid little fucking bunny game that they made up? That's what this feels like. Ah, oh, shit. This feels like... This feels like the game you would get like a four-year-old? Or like your Mormon cousin who's not allowed to have anything nice. Or fun. Oh, they let me do more this time. I mean, that's something. It's, uh, I mean, there's snow, I guess. It's not really changing anything, it just looks different. <sighs> Man, I would, uh... Yeah, I do not like this. And there we go! Jump! And there we go. This is this is torturous. I'm done. I'm done with Crocs World. Delete. These games are awful. So boring. Give me something interesting to do. Alright, uh we're not doing any of the like super talky ones yet. Not the Contra one yet. Come on, give me some quick. Give me some quick. Death Square, the employee evaluation. Let's try that. It's just Death Squared. All right. Oh, it's loading. I thought I needed to like do something to prompt it. Whoop, whoop. Smug SMG shaking my gams. Go on, go on up there. Okay. Audio levels are set. Let's get into it. Two or four player. Well, I don't have either. So, never mind. Uh, I will... I will delete that for now. I'll archive it, and then I'll find another player at some point. This is gonna be a long-running series, because there's already... like, 300... 365... Uh, 365 demo to get through. Who, what's a good one to just pop through quick? Explosive Jake. Let's try Explosive Jake. That looks like a platformer. Explosive Jake. Okay. We're in. Lone times you. Or maybe it's supposed to be sometimes you. Pigeon dev. Pigeon's not a dev. Pigeon's a bird. <coughs> ah. Oh, goodness. Alright. Let me turn the audio down a little bit. Start game. Oh, Jesus, it's loud. Oh. Oh, okay. Stand up, there you go. You were dreaming. You want to get out of here, too? 
Yeah, bomb. Okay. So it's Bomberman rules. Got it. I'm guessing this is supposed to be an indication of, like, do we hear? Sure. Okay, so it's like, if Bomberman was on, like, NES. You know, that's not terrible. Give me the torch. Can't have it. Okay. Then I guess I'm supposed to... Yeah? No. Didn't do anything there. Ah, break. Well, that didn't really help me any. Or no, the key was down there. Whoops. So I am just like a grunt skeleton. Got it. Went out of range. This guy's gonna be in range. like if Bomberman was more story-based, I guess. God damn it! I thought it had dissipated. It had not. the whole, like, making it look like a CRT screen and everything is cute, but, I don't know, it doesn't really change much. It's just Bomberman, bro. Not a style of gameplay I've ever been a huge fan of. I did it. I beat level zero. Let's do level one. Let's see, there's a button there. It's probably useful. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Hmm. Some ghosts, which is like a Pac-Man thing. Or is it just that because it's fantasy? Oh, boy. It's alright. I don't know, it's just like, this is the kind of game that I would have played when I was like five and probably had a great time with. But now, as an adult, I'm like, I don't care. I don't have the patience. Yep. Uh, I'll play, I'll play till the top of the hour. How about that? Why is his name Jake? Why is he so explosive? Who gave him this barm? Should he have this? Hey, who gave you this? Shit. Come on, I can get past this. This is nothing. This is standard platforming, whatever. Platforming? No, this isn't platforming. What am I saying? This is just standard gameplay. Son of a bitch! Come on! It's not that it's a hard. I just. It's, it's it's like when you play the really easy songs in Guitar Hero, and you end up making a bunch of really dumb mistakes because they're so slow, and it's like so hard to keep the fucking rhythm! It's 
similarly, it's like, this isn't hard, it's just really frustrating when you are consistently, like, have to redo the same parts. Okay, there we go. Dang. The, uh, the music kicked into some high gear. I think I can get through this level. Come on. This ain't hard. It's just slow. Come on, come on. Whoa. Oh, right, I gotta find a key and a door. Well, let's see which we find first. You, you are by me. Aw, oh, damn it. Yeah, I think that's enough of explosive Jake. This game's fine. I just have no interest in finishing it. If that's your thing, you'll probably like it, but ain't my thing. No siree, Bob. All right, I'm going to take another break, and then I will be RB. So do not touch the internet dial. Don't go.
Okay, I have returned. I'm going to maybe go another hour. Honestly, oh boy. Honestly, man, I'm already getting kind of tired. <laughs> uh, There's a lot of demos, a lot of not so great demos, but we're going to scoot uh, over for a moment into a specific one for the Almost Gone. This is a game that I'm very excited for, so I definitely want to see the uh, demo for it. Or wait, would it be under A? All, almost T the almost gone where's it at where's it at L M N O P Q R S T T T S T there it is the almost gone there's no title on it okay so I'm gonna change up the title here the almost gone there we go let's do it let's see how this works out if you're watching right now I'd appreciate it if you considered following it does help the channel a great deal and I do plan to stream quite a bit coming up and everything so it's a good way to get notifications whenever I go live if you're interested in that you also see down below what my schedule is. I'm going to be streaming all weekend. Tomorrow and the next day I'll be screaming, screaming quite a bit at Super Mario Sunshine. Best with headphones? Good. I'm wearing them. In fact, let's uh, turn the volume up a bit. As with all of these, I'd recommend playing it on your own if you want the full experience, but uh, let's see how it works out. Empty. Sensitive material and handles mature topics that will be distressing to some players. Oh boy. Well, I hope y'all are ready. We're getting to the hard stuff. Is it voiceover? No. Am I awake? Doesn't feel like it. But it certainly doesn't feel like being asleep. The house. A moment after. Please let this be a dream. Hmm. Ooh, ooh, pointer. Okay. A. Looks really old, this box. Like a tiny treasure chest. The handle is missing. Ah, I can twist around. Okay, fan it. But where's all my stuff? Uh, oh, I take it from the... Ooh, I like that. I can look all over at it. Cool. X. Use. And box. Hmm. What's this? Go to the treehouse. You'll be safe there. R stick. Uh, oh, okay. Got it. Okay. What do I got to see here? It's a globe. Right. Globe, so typical of my father. I say one thing about stars and he fills half my room with zodiac sign stuff. Here's something rattling inside when I turn it around. <gasps> Puzzle. Hmm. Make it glow. Okay. Can make two of them glow. Which ones? Hmm. Come back. I feel like I need a clue for that one. Uh, that? Nope. Right. That's the whole thing. So I nagged them both for a pet. It was n a no, but she gave me this cactus. Her kind of humor. Sharp. Empty books. Whoever thought of this is just plain lazy. Clearly not mom's idea. She'd have gone that extra mile. Always freaks me out seeing myself just after waking up. That one? Nope. That one. I memorized all the zodiac signs to recite during our camping trips. I believe I have spent half my life sitting in that chair. 
Sometimes I like a poster bear on the floor, like a cool little carpet. Hmm. That's about everything I can do in here. Or, oh, wait a minute. It's all the thing over the cactus. Unless... Oh, okay, that's just if you click away to let you know that it has a little thing that it's saying. Got it. Looped back to here. Oh, that's right, I can turn stuff around. Hold on. Is there any clues on this side? Hmm, nope. Uh, what about in here? Draft of this house as my father would draw it. It's always much more rigid, much more technical. Even in a dream, I couldn't believe it, and yet I can see it and touch it. What, the tree? During our camping trips, my dad will always point to those stars, tell me they would lead me home. That's what I need. Okay. That's... I do not know that constellation, to be honest. Not great with constellations. Honestly, like, they look... <laughs> constellations look fun when they're drawn out with and, like, lined up and everything, but it's rarely the case. In actuality, they're generally, like... It's kind of gibberish. All right, it was the guy kind of... Which one? This one. That guy. Did that do it? Ah. The secret hatch. Can I... Can I open it now? Is that it? Okay, no. Nope. Almost. That one. Am I just going to have to trial and error this? Probably, I feel like there's probably a clue somewhere. But... Hmm. Ah, oh, boy. Okay. I'm really going to have to go one by one like this. All right. Come on, then. I, I can guarantee there's a better way to do this, but... I'm just... I'm being lazy. It's, it's laziness that's causing me a lot of extra work. There it is! Ooh, pretty. A key. Finally. Woo, 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 woo. Cool. Uh. Locked. Why can't I leave? Well, because you haven't got the key now, have you? Click it in. Moving box? Who was thinking of leaving? Or did they move loads of stuff over here? My father's projects get rejected. Possible to build, they said, although every detail's worked out perfectly. Oh, my father. Okay, so that's the space room. So that, that's like a bunch of scratches. I hear shards of voices in the wind, fragments of all the fights in this house. My parents' room locked. Is somebody else in there or something? Oh! Whoa! Whoa! the hell? Is that coming out of the toilet? It doesn't move like a liquid. It's too slow. Uh, concerning. Sometimes they get really angry with me if I came down during the night. Shiny and me was about the only thing they still did together. Yeesh. That's depressing. Half the books are gone. Every book has my name on it. Every, bo every box has my name on it. Hmm. Alright, let's go downstairs. 
That's where we came from. Hold on, we go upstairs then. Uh, that way? No. No, there was a different path for the downstairs. Got it. Gotta do it like this. There we go. Treat. Plant. What do you got? Oh. We would go camping without her. She didn't want to come, she said. She would always protest, but we'd go anyway. Some secret? Sneaky secret? Hmm. Uh, yes. Yes. Vacuum. Vacuum. Record. I shouldn't be here. This was the first dance of their wedding. Too cheesy for my taste. Sometimes when she thinks I can't hear it, she listens to this song. Very quiet and on repeat. Oof. Bro, that's some sad town. Is this door open? Hmm. Record. This thing is older than me. The only wedding present they were both really happy about. So many books. Okay, we get it. Lots of books. Hmm. Uh. Whoa, spices. Yeah, 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 he never cooked. The classics. Can I take the wine? Give it to me. Hmm. Well, I guess we gotta look at it eventually. You can feel a huge coldness coming from inside the fridge, like a captured snowstorm. Yeah, it's a refrigerator, bud. They're cold. Another lock. Another secret. Ah, okay. I gotta make a picture. Let's go like this. Like this. Hmm. Like that. Yeah? No. Like this? Hmm. Like this. Yeah. Maybe. When. Who? Well, that's as close as I can get. Oh, wait a minute. A? That's the letter A, right? B. Whoop. There goes the Elgato. Well, if it does that again, I'll reset it. Oh, you spilled your wine. Oh, no. Do not mix with alcohol. Ooh. Yikes. This was her space, her retreat from all the horrors of this world. She left a tissue. Nasty. Keys are worn, the letters faded in spots. She spent a lot of time writing. Since when is everything locked in this house? Okay, so alcohol... Pills. Pills are 50. Booze and a pregnancy test? Why does she always hide her stuff? I knew she felt a bit down, but clinically depressed? Is that why she takes so much medication? Oh, that was that was a clue for the uh the fridge. Anything up here? Yes, yes, yes. Very sad. Very sad. Can I turn her computer off? 
food? No. Nope. Okay. Was that a telescope? Never make him sad. Empty. Should be full of paperwork. Furniture always sounds like an angry animal devouring something. Horrible. Let. Ah, and there's the other one. What? She wanted a divorce? Wanted to take me away? Doesn't my opinion count? I just another thing to move around? Won't even start. Plans for the treehouse. He cared more about that thing than I did. They never tell me that the treehouse was real. They finally finished it. Oh, yep. Yeah, hold on. Gotta reset the Elgato. Should take just a moment. I'm probably gonna reconnect it to my USB hub, honestly, because, like... Doesn't look like it really helped much to, uh, put it on its own thing. I need to see the wine. I cannot. Hmm. Or if they watch their wedding, vi wedding video together. Or did they just watch it alone? Okay. I get it. Divorce. It's sad. It's sad. But, uh... Keep going off like this. Wait. No. Whoa, I haven't been in here yet. Or have I? Zephyrin Chichao. The hands keep turning faster than the shortest second. Outside, there is a darkness which absorbs all light and sound. I don't know how, but I need to get there. Get to the impossible treehouse. Cuckoo, cuckoo. There's a stack over here. Anything? A clue, perhaps. Hmm. Okay, let's get back to the kitchen, because I knew that there were... I knew there are some uh, clues there. Also, can I pick up this record? Yes. B. Kitchen. Not the kitchen. The foyer. Kitchen. Not the kitchen. The stairs. Kitchen. Well, since I'm here. Use. Listen. Oh, hey. A VHS tape. Wedding. Oof. It's pretty soulless. Okay, there we go. Let's see. So it was this with the cross. And uh, what was the, the B one? It is a dreidel. Mazel tov. Shit, not what I meant to do. There it is, unlocked. Cold. There's the bottle. 16. Okay, cold. Always the same disgusting herbs. Lady, I guess I assume lady. Don't be so judgy, all right? What herbs you use, huh? What, some thyme? Some oregano? It's a whole ass cake. Hmm. Now 
where's the puzzle here? Oh, just hit it. Oof. Oh, there's a pregnancy test. Gross. In the cake? Nasty. Alright, so that should give us everything we need to open the safe. No, not that way. Boy, I wish I got, like, any kind of idea of the floor plan for this fucking place. No. This way? Nope, that's the kitchen. Come on now. Let me go. Uh, or was the safe upstairs? No. I don't think so. Was it? It was in the computer room, which might have been upstairs. Duck. Uh, through here. No. Come on. Down the down the stairs. I guess I gotta go to the the landing for it to let me descend. That way. Ah, uh, closer. Oh, that's the kitchen. It's a dining room. There's the safe. Okay, so it's uh alcohol pills pregnancy test yeesh that's a dark set of objects all right 1650 1650 2 i guess or 11 so 16 Shit, now I fucked it up. Damn it. Sixteen fifty eleven. Yep, there it is. More booze and a key. The key to their bed through bed bedroom. Bedroom. Okay, now I just gotta remember how the hell to get back there. This way. Nope. Oh boy, my stomach's growling. I think I'll probably end it after this demo. Get some food. Anything there? Nah. And uh, that one, yes. Uh, yep, use. We're going in. The end of the demo. Ooh, boy. It's out. So, yeah, that's... Wow, that was that was really cool. Um, a bit heavy-handed, I will admit. But, it's fun enough. You know? Successfully archived. You know, I'm almost to the end of the hour. I'll, I'll go till at least the top of the hour here, you know? Why not? Let's let's try one of these other ones. Uh, coffee talk. Yeah, no. Nah. Let's let's go with Contra Rogue Core, the shittiest looking game to come out on the Switch. It looks like it's for like original PlayStation. It looks awful. 
Why do they hate, like, Contra, dude? Why do they not want to give it, like, a decent shake? I do not expect this game to be good, but maybe I'll be pleasantly surprised. Let's find out. Toy Logic. Huh. All right. Let's do it. Oh, good. Couch Co-op. I do appreciate that. Damned spirit. Heesh, yeah, see what I mean? Oh my god, this looks so stupid. Again, similar to how Crocs World looks like a fake game for a GameStop ad, this also looks like a shitty fake game for a GameStop ad. Let's go. All right, moving. Oh boy. Your weapon control restarted. Try shooting something. Yeah. Trigger to shoot. Watch it closely. When it's full, your weapon overheats and you won't be able to fire for a while. Okay, got it. Okay, can there's no, uh... There's a way on the other side of that wall. Jump over it. Oh, Jesus. I mean, it is Contra, but Jesus. Um, I mean, I'm glad that it just takes camera control away from you. Stay alert. Wait, am I trapped? It's okay. To open the gate, you just need to... Frag all the thieves. Bingo. Let's do it. Take them out. Take them out. Get him, get him, get him. Hell yeah. What? Oh. This is okay. If this was on, like, original PlayStation, it would be awesome. This looks like garbage. Oh, overheat. Wait for it. Okay. If I tap the weapon, it does, like, a little less than the same rate of fire, but... There we go. But it also doesn't overheat, so... I don't know. Who the hell are even any of these characters? I don't give a shit. They've given me no reason to give a shit. Health. Health dropped. I feel like they saw that Doom did well and they were like, we can make a game as fun. Oh, Jesus. Wow, why the hell didn't I just use this before? This would have been so much more useful. Oh, Jesus. Came right at the camera. Okay. Honestly, yeah, it's depressing that this game came out, like, this year, but it's pretty fun, gotta admit. Whoa, throne. Whoa, shit. Oh, Jesus Christ. I did not expect it to do that. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. There's so many. Oh, 
Uh, ZL, got it. I feel like I was meant to go up there. Oh, okay. That guy was having some troubles. Is there like lore to Contra and stuff? I get it that it's like you're fighting aliens, I think. It's like Red, Red Hawk, Falcon, some. I don't know. I never played the original Contra. Looked okay. Just kind of looked like a schmuck. Oh, um, looked like a schmuck. Heh <laughs> heh. <laughs> I do it, I do it, joke. I do it, joke from time to time. And they did really make this feel like 3D Contra. Which I don't think is their first attempt to do so. Whoa. Oh, that's it. It's like an arcadey twin stick shooter kind of thing. Good thing. There we go. Boy. Really didn't need to have him say the fuck word. And here's the thing I'm not a prude, but like. It's pretty obvious when you only have your character swear to sound like cool and edgy. Like, oh, this is the. This, this isn't your dad's Contra. This is Contra for a. Uh, to grown up peoples. But, uh, you know, it's actually way more immature to do it that way. It, it, it just sounds like a fucking six year old doing, like. It's like, hey, who said you could say that? Tee hee hee hee, rebellious. But this uh, weapon overheat system kind of blows. This is annoying. Whoops. Oh no. I'm dead. Oh, wait, maybe not. This guy's just bigger. Oh, now I'm dead. And I'm back. Okay. That's very arcadey. In fact, it feels like this is just an arcade game that they ported. Is that what happened? Like, did they just port an ar uh, Contra arcade game? Thunk. Oh. <laughs> That's pretty ridiculous. Listen, I'm not the type to be like, oh, graphics. Most times, because there's a lot of things you can do with shitty graphics, but like, how the fuck did they make a game in this day and age with the technology we have that looks this bad? You know? I don't get it. The gate's locked? Um, I don't have the codes. I'll just shoot down this fucker. Cool. Great dialogue, guys. You did it. I sure love these characters. It's trying to be like Duke Nukem or something, but it's just not. Oh, Jesus. In fact, this makes me think of like, what was it? Like Super C? The like really shitty Contra? Was it shitty? Or maybe it was just like really hard. I don't remember. The line with difficulty and like quality is very blurred when it comes to Contra in specific. Did it. We got him. 
Oh god, my stomach is a grumbling. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to have like a big old dinner after this. I gotta use up. We got we keep getting these huge things of lettuce. <laughs> and I well not exactly lettuce, you know, greens. Whatever. And uh yeah, we we do not go through it fast enough before it goes bad. It sucks, because I I like it. I like having salad and stuff. Just it's real real hard to to actually get through it sometimes, you know? Okay. Here's a bit of challenge. Oh shit, it's first shot. Fine, I don't need to get it all. Oof. And I'm dead. And I'm back. Yeah, see, dying when it immediately comes back is, uh, it's almost like it doesn't even matter. I don't know, do I have like a life count I'm not seeing? Probably. Oh, oh no. this is that the end of the demo is that all we get oh big boy oh my god it's the revenant from doom full, full, full on I guess he doesn't have a jetpack he's got the shoulder cannons and everything I did it. Oh. So you let me start the fucking boss? Whatever. That actually was okay. Um, It looks like shit, though. And it looks like shit, and it's, like, written like shit to the point that, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna get that. Nope, nope, nope. I got it. I got it. I gotta stop. I gotta go eat. So, with that said, thank you for watching, whether it's in the past, present, or future. If you missed the earlier parts of the stream and want to catch them, you can watch on the past broadcast tab, which is the last 60 days worth of streams. You can also go down below to find Iggy Kid Twitch Archive. It's a link to the YouTube channel where I upload all of my past streams. They're all on there. You can also find uh, my personal YouTube, Iggy and the Ape, where I just posted a new video that I hope people enjoy. It's about voice acting and stuff, which I am a voice actor. And I also post some reviews and things. I posted a review of the Fallout game a couple weeks ago, which I think uh, is pretty good. Fallout board game, that is. Um, if you want to catch any future streams, you can check the schedule down below, or if you click the channel icon there and go to the schedule tab, you can see the full schedule there with times and everything. That's all subject to change, though, so if you want to make sure you don't miss a stream, follow me on Twitter, at IggyDKid, and turn on notifications so that you get the tweets I put out every time I go live. I always tweet out before I go live. And you can uh, follow. It's free for you if you have an account, and it really helps out the channel. If you set up notifications, you can get notified on text, notification if you got the app, um, email, whenever I go live. So that's the best way to do it would be to follow me and... I'd really appreciate it if you considered it. I'm going to be streaming uh, tomorrow and the next day. I'm going to be streaming a lot of Super Mario Sunshine. So if you're interested in that, come back around for that. 
And yeah, I hope to see you there. So with all that said, once again, I want to thank you for inviting me into your home, your phone, your computer, your tablet, your gaming console, your laptop, whatever it is, whatever way that you decided to watch tonight. I really appreciate it. I hope I brought some levity and entertainment into your life. I do my best, and I hope you'll join me this weekend for some Super Mario Sunshine. Really love to see you guys there. And hey, if no one else has said this to you, I'll say this to you right now. You're a good kid. Thanks for watching, everybody. Goodbye. Good night. Goodbye. Come check out the Super Mario Sunshine tomorrow, 5 o'clock, 3 o'clock. I don't know. Afternoon. Come check it out. Good night. Goodbye.